start my video. Happy birthday to my niece Angel. I think you turned 16 today? It's definitely your birthday. Not sure if you're 15 or 16, but I'm 90% sure it's 16. Obviously, I am the best kind of aunt with our few year age difference and not visiting for six, seven years. <laughs> Family is difficult. Especially, you know, when you're in high school and college and, you know, can't visit them. But yeah, it's cool. Angel, actually growing up, we were pretty much best friends, which was nice. It was very convenient for my parents and for her parents to, you know, have that. Because it was just easy. Babysitting your little sister also means getting a play date for your kid. Having the grandkids over is also kind of nice because your actual kids will entertain them. It's weird. My family's odd. My sister is old enough to be my mom. Quite a few of my siblings are old enough to be my mom, actually, now that I think about it. I guess my brother's probably old enough to be my dad. I'm not really sure how old any of them are. It escapes you after a while. And another thing. Today is the sixth day of Veda and I'm already worn out. Like I'm really tired from doing the daily vlog every day, you know, hence its name on this channel, and then doing stuff on my main channel every day. It's kind of exhausting. I spend a lot of time in front of the computer now. I guess I always spend a lot of time in front of the computer, but now it's now it's more time. Now it's at least an extra hour and a half to two hours designing thumbnails and editing videos and sorting through things into files and writing scripts and just, uh, I'm tired. I don't get to go home and take a nap. I have to go home and edit the beta video for today, which is cool. It's about science and I like science. It's a fun subject with lots of interesting things about our world you can learn. But I'm really tired. So, yeah. Anyways, happy birthday, Angel! That's... Good job living another year. So me and Zach are going to the store to buy stuff that we need. Yep. I thought you wanted to be in the video. What's wrong? Oh, your shirt? Yeah, it's a nice shirt. It was in my room because sometimes that's where his clothes look at. Stop it! Yes, he's wearing two shirts. He has his yellow shirt and his Spongebob shirt because he likes both shirts so much that he couldn't pick and he likes football. As you can see there are lots of topics to discuss when there's a four-year-old around. Look at these beautiful flowers that are so out of focus and in focus. Huzzah! It's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful place. I like that spring's coming and flowers are coming in. The grass may mostly be brown, but that's okay. Sky is blue, birds chirping, flowers blooming. I've got a pretty good deal around here. <sighs> and yeah, that's about it. I don't know much is really happening today. I did some work. My mom made some chicken noodle soup. Homemade, of course, as she likes to be sure to point out. Yep. Not a, not a whole ton happening. I'm gonna go over to Victor's after work. I'm on play to work now, and then just kind of hang out with him. Uh, he just went to Tadco, so maybe he'll have something to say. The next clip will probably be him talking, in fact. Hey. So tell me about Tadco. Oh, hello, Tadco is, does your daily vlog know what Tadco is? Yeah, I don't know if I said it. Teco is Pittsburgh Anime Convention. It used to be called Teco Shokan. They dropped the Shokan because having the word con in your title makes people think you're a con, and then they, I guess they don't want people. I don't know. It's also hard to pronounce. Yeah. Um, yeah. So I only went because it was cheap and I could, you know, walk to it. So that was nice, um, 
So yeah, I've never been to a con before. Like I spent less than a day at one before when I was like a kid, and it was just like we just walked around the show floor and looked basically. So this was, you know, panels and screenings and artists and vendors and meeting all kinds of cool people that are so cool that you stand out in the cold and talk to them for four hours. Yeah. Um, so let's stop. Let's look at my stuff. Okay. What stuff would you like to show off first, Victor? This is the guidebook. I was going to get one. This stuff, it looks like crap because it like rubs off like very easily. I was going to get a better one when I mm. left just to show off, but I forgot. Um, there's a map on the back that's really confusing and like a fraction of important info is in the actual book. Like it says that it gives descriptions of the panels and the schedule just said like when they were and what they were called. So now we knew what they were about. But like I never knew when bag checked would close. Oh wait. There's a whole never mind. It does say that. <laughs> Here's the badge. Regular people get the steampunk girl. If you paid extra money you could get premium, which is the steampunk boy. It's, it's that guy who's under the crappy burn mark that looks like crap. Premium looks like a waste of money. You get a fancy red bag. I think that's it. No, there's a premium lounge, which is just like the normal rooms with tables and the normal chairs that everyone gets. But like, there was candy on the tables. And they were showing Summer Wars, which is a good movie at one point. So what other stuff did you get? Yeah. Okay. Um, this is a long clip. Sorry. Okay, this is a print that I got. It was a dollar, so why not? It's Dragon Ball, and it's adorable, and the artist was nice. So, you know, a dollar for a thing, why not? Um, the... I gotta... Let me pick out some of these. Oh, damn. He got a lot of cards. Yeah, I got some of the new Digimon just, cards. Just, can we leave it at that? Which, but look how pretty the bat, like, look, it's, it's the old school artwork. It's beautiful. Uh-huh. Like, I don't know the, the difference. Some of the cards, like, have, like, artwork from the 90s, so it's, 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 they're beautiful. Um, so I'm going to be giving those away in my podcast. Cool. Somebody was cosplaying as No Face from Spirited Away. <sighs> Okay. It's like a big black blob with a weird face. Even yes. though it's called No Face. And it, in the plot, it gives out gold or something. I don't know. But I took a picture and she gave me a little piece of gold. Cool. A uh, gold nugget. Speaking of the movie Summer Wars, a lot of the plot revolves around this weird game called Hanafuda, which is really confusing and nobody understands it. And it makes the whole climax you confusing. You bought it, didn't you? I didn't you? buy it. I, this guy was so cool and I showed interest and he just gave me a whole pack. And it's kind of interesting, so I think I'm going to learn how to play. It's really complicated. It's all about flowers. So there's that. Um, this is a Digimon plushie that was $25 and I have no use for. But I had to get it because I need it, you know? Um, the girls who made these, they're twins. And they're super adorable. And there's not a huge Digimon presence there, even though a crap load of people love it. There was a panel at midnight on Digimon, and it was like packed at midnight. So that was super nice to see that many people showing up for Digimon. So that's really cool. Um, yeah, I saw a movie called Wolf Children, which is basically this woman falls in love with the werewolf, and then he, she has his werewolf babies, and then he dies, and she's like, how do I raise these werewolf babies? Um, and then there's a lot of farming in it. It's basically a farming movie for a good half hour. It's weird. Um, yeah, I met tons of cool people. And tons of cool stuff happened. Um, a lot of lame panels I went to that I, like, walked out of. Just because they were lame. Yeah, that night there was a Digimon panel. I also woke up and was at the con at, like, noon. So I was there for 12 hours straight. So that was a lot of crazy... Um, there's also other cons advertising their cons, you know, and one of them was called, oh, I forget, but they were selling, um, Chinese Zodiac bookmarks, and so for Katrina, I got her a little Chinese Zodiac bookmark, so there you go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
And that's Teco in a nutshell. Cool. Yeah. I'm posting uh, daily journals and cosplay stuff on my website, moderngaffa.com. It's in the... It's wherever she's going to link it or she'll forget.